We all hope for a better future, that our children will be safer, healthier, more prosperous than the generation before. We expect progress, but we face an unprecedented challenge, the gravest reversal in global poverty reduction in a generation. The latest numbers are stark. Extreme poverty is rising for the first time in more than two decades. The goal of ending extreme poverty has been set back by at least three years. Most economies will see shared prosperity drop as a result of the pandemic. We are going backward. To get back on track, we must tackle three urgent global challenges. The shockwaves from the coronavirus pandemic threaten to push up to 115 million additional people into extreme poverty. In just 10 years, the effects of climate change could increase global poverty by up to 132 million. By 2030, up to two-thirds of the extreme poor could be living in fragile or conflict-affected areas. The need is urgent, the challenges are great, but this is also a moment of opportunity. The right response, putting the most effective policies into practice, could reduce inequality, build resilience, and accelerate progress. Effective action to end conflict, fragility, and instability. Promoting inclusive and steady economic growth that benefits the poorest. Providing better health, education, and infrastructure, particularly for children. But policies alone are not enough. To achieve real results, we must move from aspiration to action to attainment. Good governance that is transparent, accountable, and legitimate is needed to create a stronger partnership with citizens and to better implement inclusive policies that reduce poverty and promote shared prosperity. Our children deserve a brighter future. Reversing this reversal is possible. Let's do it together.